Golfing World caught up with Suzanne Pettersen ahead of her victory in Taiwan last week. The world number two was defending her title, having won the event back in 2012, and five of the Norwegian's 14 LPGA wins have come in Asia. No, it's always uh, great to be back in Asia. Uh, Asia last fall was very good to me, and uh, I've been playing good so far. If I finish strong, I can possibly take on number one by the end of the year. Um, obviously, I'm going to try my best. Uh, I don't look at it as a short-term goal, but obviously, if I can... Uh, try and close up the gap uh, for each week that goes by now, uh, it's, uh, it's one step closer. The final round of the Sunrise LPGA Taiwan Championship was a head-to-head -head battle with Spaniard Azahara Munoz throughout the day, but Pettersen pulled away late in the round to secure a five-stroke victory and clinch her fourth win of the season. It's been quite a year for Suzanne. She's ranked number two on tour for scoring average, and her season earnings now stand at over $2 million. And the 32-year-old can't put her finger on which performance marked the highlight of her year. Uh, it's tough to say. Obviously, major number two was big. Uh, felt like it was a big stretch there. Solheim was fantastic. Uh, Hawaii, the win. I mean, I've had a lot of great moments. I've been close a few times. I've been uh, fortunate to capture a few titles. and. Uh, to even be close to competing with Imbi, uh, with her winning three majors, uh, just says that you've had a fairly decent year yourself. The race to the Rolex Player of the Year is drawing to a close. The three players in contention for the prize are America's world number three, Stacey Lewis, Suzanne, and of course, Inby Park, a three-time major winner this season. Pettersen is chasing at the heels of the Korean world number one, having not finished less than seventh in any tournament since June. She put her stellar consistency down to an intense training schedule. I think I put down a lot of hard work in between the tournaments. Uh, I try to light up the practice when I go out to play. Uh, but um, I work pretty hard, so for me, it's uh, my confidence comes from a practice that I do at home. Uh, I know I'm prepared, I know I have done the right things, and uh, really just trying to go out and uh, play some golf.